The Shed Show team proudly support Men's Sheds and Lifeline. The Shed Show, The Shed Show. Come on. And we've been lucky enough today to be joined on The Shed Show by the President of the Victorian Med Sheds Association, Phil Coley. How are you, Phil? Good, thanks, Whiskers. Welcome to the show. Now, Thank you. Now, how long has the Men's Shed Association been operating in the country? Look, the Victorian Men's Shed have been here since 2007, which is when we incorporated as an association. Mm -hmm. uh, men's Sheds themselves, look, they stretch back into the early 2000s. It's one of the largest men's support groups in the whole of the country, is that right? Well, we are. We've got uh, 325 sheds in Victoria, around the country, and there's about 965 in Australia. The interesting fact is there are more men's sheds in Australia than there are McDonald's stores. You see it growing even bigger? Look, at the moment, since 2007, we've grown uh, by about 30 sheds a year, and at the moment, we can't see that stopping. How long have you been operating here? We kicked it off in May 2012 and in four and a bit years we've managed to get over 200 people come through and we currently have about 160 financial members. I was going to ask you how many members you have in here, but 160, that is great, isn't yeah. it? Of course, the Men's Shed do a lot for the community. What sort of activities do you get up to here? Well, we have woodworking, metal turning, uh, hobby room, blacksmithing, which is probably unique to any Men's Shed. Yeah. And uh, we have pool room and we're in the throes of building a new recreational room. A couple of sheds we've been to, there's, quite, there's a few young fellas in there as well and they're almost learning new skills. They are, they're learning new skills. They're also um, learning uh, a part of a process of mixing with other people. Uh, we've had sheds in the past that have had younger guys come on board and work with them. And I know of a number of instances where uh, the shedders have helped and aided these young boys uh, get into apprenticeships. For 40, 45 years they were a part of work, uh, whatever that might have been, and all of a sudden you've got nothing. Uh, and the men's shed gives them the ability to get back and socialise with men, to talk with men, and we've actually found that a lot of the health benefits that come out of sheds are from just blokes talking. And that leads me into, I notice you've got a bit of a program happening at the moment called Spanner in the Works. Tell us a bit about that. Yeah, the Spanner in the Works program was developed by the Australian Men's Shed Association, so the national body. Uh, and that's basically a preventative health check. We do uh, blood pressure readings, uh, cholesterol readings, um, checking for diabetes uh, through a question and answer type practice. Um, and if some of the numbers aren't sounding too well, there'll then be a recommendation to see your local doctor. It's just the simple things of um, trying to, as a group, improve the health and the well-being of men in society. There's a lot of thing about self-inclusion, isn't there? Look, there's a lot of self-inclusion. The VMSA are the peak body and we represent the sheds in Victoria. Mm -hmm. um, so we're talking with sponsors and supporters, uh, with the governments and trying to obtain funding uh, and provide the uh, the backup and the support for the individual sheds. If there are some people out there who want to start up their own men's shed in their area or their region, wherever they're from, how do they go about it? Look, there's a couple of different ways. The easiest way would be to contact our executive officer uh, on the main VMSA number or go onto our website which is uh, www.vmsa.org.au And we'll put all that up on our site as well. Yeah, and that's the easiest place and we've got a locator there that tells you where all the sheds are. Uh, the interaction that the sheds have with their local communities, local organisations, local councils, uh, there's a lot of great things that are happening out there. Thank you very much, Phil. Thanks Thank for being you. a part of the Shed Show. We greatly appreciate it. Thanks, Whiskers. Cheers. The Shed Show is brought to you by these loving people. If you'd like to sponsor the show and shed the love, get in touch today. Cheers.